number seven news at ten. It doesn't look much, but when you go to like the highway, it feels very slippery. The first snow of the season in the Denver Metro, reminding many it's time to put on the snow tires. You'll feel more confident as a driver and safer. How city crews are cleaning up the streets for a safe ride. And the snow isn't scaring people away from celebrating Halloween. Doesn't matter how cold it gets, the snow is just another day. In true Colorado style, how folks brace themselves in the snow for all of the spooky holiday thrills. Don't let the snow keep you inside. This is Colorado. Get out, enjoy the cold weather. Game against UCLA. Let's get this kicked off with a time lapse of today's first snow of the season in the Denver Metro. Looking over downtown Denver, starts around 11 a.m. and by 5 tonight, you can barely see the buildings for all the snow. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us on Jeff. And I'm Daniel Freuder. The snow is still falling right now and it will keep going in areas until tomorrow morning. So we want to begin tonight with meteorologist Stacy Donaldson for today's Weather Action Day. Well, it is going to keep snowing all night, early tomorrow. The roads are really taking a beating at this point, so if you're out and about this evening, be very careful. And if you're headed out early tomorrow, be aware that we're going to see freezing conditions on the roads and they will be very slippery. We've already seen eight inches of snow around Castle Rock, Castle Pines, about four inches in Inglewood. And the 6 p.m. reading at DIA was 2.9 inches. And I'm sure we've already seen more than that come through as we continue to see snow come